Peeps. Spending quick second, come on, guys. We're back to another video. It's S2000. Cruising. So, if you saw the previous video, we went and picked up the new S2K, which I'm extremely happy with. And today, we're going to do like a proper first little drive and like my thoughts, my first thoughts on like decent country roads and not a motorway. So I've obviously driven it back you know, yeah. for two hours yeah, yeah. or whatever it was, two and a half hour drive. Ben's still trying to get a little feel for it because as you go with these, if you uh, take your eye off the ball with it a little bit, it'll, uh, it'll have you. Very snappy, very <laughs> twitchy, a lot of power. Well, not loads of power, but it's just, it's the way it's put down and the way the engine's designed. And well, anyone that drives a VTEC engine will know all about that. But yeah, it's, uh, it's so much fun, mate. So much it's my fun. first time in it, and it's great. I love it. We did as a, little, a passenger. Had a little play going along the road earlier, didn't we? And yeah. Chris was quite shocked. Yeah. How much it does pull? Mate, it really uh, does. Unbelievable! Literally, you're at five thousand revs, and it's just. It's like mm. it's, it's, you, you're going and going and going, and it's different in the FM because you know when you get you, you know when you get into nine thousand. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you look down in here, you think you're about eight, eight and a half, and you're at like six. <laughs> it's stupid. And it's like, shit, I've still got like half the fucking rev range to go. It's crazy. And it's, and it, I haven't given it full beans for obvious reasons because it's very slippery. Yeah. And uh, it's cold, and yeah, it's, it's, it's a little bit frightening at times. I'm not mm. going to lie. <laughs> I know, I know, because Ben's constantly driving like this with both his hands yeah, on the wheel. He's like this. You have to change gear so fast to keep both hands on the wheels and end up in a fucking <laughs> ditch. <laughs> But it is Brilliant. I love a it, proper mate. driver's car, yeah, so totally we'll, we'll film good. a little bit of me driving and chatting a bit about it and my thoughts of it and stuff, and then we'll get some pulls and a couple of flybys and uh, yeah, a couple of wheel it's spins. Be fun. Be nice. This is first proper experience of one, isn't it? It is, mate. Yeah, totally. Yeah, so uh, yeah, very impressed. Love it. There's a nice bit of road just down this way where we're parked up. No yeah. one here, obviously. No, it's fucking dead. That's what I mean. It's an empty car park. Yeah, it is an empty. That car only park. means one thing. What? what does that mean? Donuts. Donuts, baby. He's trying to push. And then if you want to do it, I've never done a donut in a car. Can, we'll try. Never done it. I'll do it. Fuck off, me. What? I'll let you have a go, but you're not letting me have to go do a donuts. Well, I'm only going to do like a little spin. Just do a little spin. Come on. Let's try. try. Let's try it. Your attempt at donuts. That's going to be horrendous. All right, come on then, Benj. I've never done one before. I don't even know how you do it. All you do is drive over there. One. Turn, turn quick and plant your foot. Okay. And you'll get the ass end around. All right. Okay. I'll try. So go. There's a nice bit of tarmac over there. Look. Let's turn this shit down. Right. So. Ready? Oh, there is that. Yeah. I don't want to do this. I want to do it the other way. Right. Turn. I'm a bit scared. Hang on. Turn, plant your foot. Hang on. There we go! <laughs> yes, baby! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. That is how you do it, son. <laughs> how do you feel? You've just done your first donut in an S2K. Uh, I feel quite exhilarated. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm feeling be, a little man. bit bad on my baby for putting her through that. Avons on the back. Fuck the Avons, mate. <laughs> True. Shred them. <laughs> True. Right. Yeah, mate. So it's fucking great. Look at this bonnet, there. Oh my god, it's a thing of beauty. It is. It's my favourite bit of the body lines. I love it. But yeah, as I was saying, it's. If I could describe it in one word, I think it would be raw. Very. Don't you think? Yeah, very. It is. It's like, it's, it feels like a fucking train, honestly. Mate, I'm actually, I'm, I'm, I'm quite shocked though by the ride comfort on it. It's, yeah, it ain't bad. It's actually, I think it's more comfy than the FN. Ain't bad. To be honest it. with you. National speed limit up here. Is it? Engine with 
no fucking turbos or chargers or anything like that on it. I don't think I've driven anything better. I really don't. Handles good. The steering is just ridiculous. It's so fucking responsive. It is instant. Which is from going from the FN to this is why I've been taking it easy. Because if you're planting it and you go around a corner, you forget that there's no like steering lag. Yeah, yeah. So as soon as you turn, you're, you're fucking turned. Do you know what I mean? It's fucking. It's insane. I absolutely love it. <laughs> I do. It's, I've never driven a car like it. It's brilliant. Mate, I'm getting fucking. I get a bit of an adrenaline rush when you plant your foot. You do. And I've, I've never really got that in something that hasn't got boost or something like that. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I've never really got it. I mean, I used. To, I get the buzz out of the FN, but it's not as savage, is it? No. I mean, not as savage at all. And this is. Well, like I said, it's just raw as fuck. And you can feel everything, every fucking bump, every everything. It's amazing. You know where you are with it, and you know your limit. And I ain't experienced enough driving it. I've only driven it for three hours to be fucking caning it through these fucking twisties at fucking 60 mile an hour. Yeah. So we'll probably end up in a bush. But there's a nice bit of road coming up in a minute. Three quarters of a donut. Mate. Did I go all the way around? Yeah, mate. Did I? Yeah. <laughs> If we listened to me, we would have probably got arrested then because I said do it again, and as we were going to do it again, the copper would have caused. Yeah, but we had we had we've got um, we have permission off of the uh, landowner to do it, didn't we? So, it doesn't matter. Of course. Look at his little face there. In this fucking gearbox, I've never driven a car with a gearbox like this before. Honest to God, it is phenomenal. It's fucking clunky and notchy. The fucking throw on it is just minuscule. It's you can tell that they built this car with a view that it's f fucking racing. Really, yeah, yeah. It's everything about it, mate. It's just it's fucking nuts. The, the, the throw is just absolutely nothing. It feels like it's Love got it. a short shift on it, and it's yeah. completely standard. Yeah, it has. It's fucking. It's amazing. Absolutely brilliant. Wet patch. <laughs> <laughs> Semi on. That's fucking beamers in the way. Fucking holiday makers. Lovely bit of road this is when there's no cars. Very windy and twisty. Do I have a little talk about what um, what my plans are, shall we? Yeah, why not? Well, I bought it purposely. Bone, bone stop. For obvious reasons, because a in my eyes, well not in my eyes, because I don't thrash my FN a lot. The modified car generally is, depending on who's owned it and modified it, maybe thrashed a bit more than a stock one. I'd associate a stock one a bit more with an older gentleman or lady, do you know what I mean? That goes for nice Sunday cruises, so I'm bouncing it off 9,000 RPM every time. But anyway. Um, What's the point in driving if you don't bounce exactly, it off limiters? Exactly. So, to start with, obviously, as we spoke in the previous video, we're just going to fucking rust treat the shit out of it and get all that sorted once we actually get bumpers and wheels off and that and have a look. Then, I think uh, it's going to be we'll change the wheels, coil overs, exhaust, and I think just those three things, obviously, fully, fully service it, etc. Um, yeah, just those three things alone. These cars look lush. They're slightly they lower. They yeah. Got a nice alloy and a decent sound of exhaust system. I want to sort the engine bay out because the rocker covering that is rough as fuck. That's we shall show you in a bit. Um, and yeah, I already know like my colour scheme that I'm going to go with. Which I'm not going to reveal just yet. But yeah, I mean, this road's lush when you haven't got anywhere in front of you. Like some of these though, you fucking sideways round here by. 
lived in this area all my life and never been down here. You can get the ferry, uh, drive down here, there's a car park at the bottom, you get the ferry across and over to Dartmouth over there. Oh, right. It's over in the missus. Or we could just do it, we could have a romantic date. Or you can, you can drive across the river on the car ferry, obviously. Drive onto the car ferry, get taken over there. Very nice. I went to school in Dartmouth. Did that you? was my secondary school, I used to get a bus from Payton to Kingswear, then a ferry, then another bus up to school every day. That's where all the glue sniffing and things. <laughs> <laughs> Substance. You're a substance. This abuse. is called the banjo, not to be uh, confused with the banjo on your penis. Then we don't want to slap the banjo. Oh my god, look at this for a turn. You could have well had the ass end out there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, and then that, and then you go shoot all the way back on it again. It's a lovely stretch of road. have a go. He's a bit nervous. I'm shitting myself here now. But just take it easy mate. I just if anything you don't even have to hammer it just get a feel for it and just I want you to just feel the, how lush the steering is and the oh he says that here we fucking go. Jesus Christ. Watch it on the corners. That's different bit in the passenger seat. <laughs> sure I like this. You sure you're happy with this mate especially with my spatial awareness. Right. 
drive it, the more I get used to it and that, you know? I'd like to go on like drift courses and stuff. That'd be fun. The suspension's good as well, isn't it? I mean, Very good. It's like hardly any roll in the corners or anything, is it? With an S2K. Out of here, fucking hell. Anyone else's car, I'll be fine in it, but I know <laughs> what you're like with it already. So I'm like, oh my god, just take it steady, though. Oh my god. You haven't got that steady. It's just, and these are extremely slippery roads, as you can see. Wet leaves and Chrysler's whatever else. It's, uh, yeah, they're great roads, amazing in the summer. And obviously, in our previous videos, you've seen me going up onto the National Park of Dartmoor. The roads up there are phenomenal. I can't wait for the spring and the summer to get the top down and just just enjoy it. I, I cannot wait. I'm just so fucking stoked. It's ridiculous. It was amazing, but you've literally just got to keep your fucking wits about you all the time. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, you have, yeah, yeah. You but can see why they say it's. I was like, when I drove your FN, though, wasn't I? Yeah, you were. But in this instance, I'm not getting one of these. Let's just get that straight. <laughs> <laughs> straight away. I think I actually would be single. <laughs> yeah, probably. Right, I need to find a petrol station. Which I know that would make, uh, was it Kelly, innit? Yeah, make you very happy, Kells, if I become single. But I'm afraid, but. <laughs> Like, Fuck's sake. Should I get one? <laughs> <laughs> Disgusting boy. Oh, oh brilliant. Stalled it. Ingen. All that driver, he stalls it parking. <laughs> Let me get out. I need to get out. I need air. Oh, I'm still struggling to get out of the fucker. There she is. Well, thank you very much, mate, for trusting me with it. She's a beaut. Even though I didn't even give it full beans, but. She's filthy now. But yeah. These are going to go. Well, I might just colour code them to start with. I want to get the splitter. 
just to finish the front end off. New wheels, obviously, Coelho's exhaust system. It's gonna look sick. The point is washing it last night, won't it, when we come in? It was a little bit, mate. Yeah. Well, let's pop the hood, shall we? It's a bit of a mess under here. Oh, the lighting's horrendous. A bit of a mess under here. There's like this here. I'm gonna replace all this trim bit, which you can buy, actually. There's a guy on one of the groups I've already joined that's got <coughs> one of them and the rubber strip for sale, so I might buy that off of him. But all the mounts on that are solid. I mean, it's just generally a good solid car. These I can are easily replace, which I will do. The rocker cover is shabby as light, but there don't seem to be any leaks or anything really. It seems to run decent. Yeah, it really does. And it's going to be so easy to get to and change this rocker cover and everything. Isn't oh it? yeah, mate. It's, it's so easy to work on. Uh, anything I need to change it, I'm going to do the oil anyway. I need to change the filter because that doesn't look like a Honda OEM filter. And, Apparently on these it's quite important that they are. Even that mate, look how easy it is to yeah, get mate. to. <laughs> it's it's easy and right, right below that is the drain yeah. plug. As simple as that. So yeah, it's gonna be easy to work on them. The FNs, they're a pain in the ass, aren't they? No, they, they are. Really, they're, really they're, are. That's just like an engine cram. Even though they're amazing, yeah. obviously. Yeah, but they they're just are. like crammed into a yeah. small fucking space. They fucking are, but yeah, I'm looking forward to Look at this air to get intake, mate. Look at the size it. of this air intake. Oh, it's tried almost, isn't it? Might change all that out. We shall see, but it's just like the FN. I've been doing that over what four years, yeah, to get it where it is now. So it's going to be a not a quick project, a long project, but it's going to be a project that you guys will be going on with us, yeah, yeah, totally. So it's uh, it looks good. like it's got a that's an alarm, isn't it? Yeah, that's an alarm sound by the looks of it, yeah, I think. So it looks like it's had a it's got an immobilizer in that on it that was, that's not factory. So, uh, all the time, it's it does. Like I'm still figuring two out. Two fobs how to exactly the same. It. Yeah. It's just like still figuring out how to use it. Yes. But yeah, I am exactly. so so chuffed with this car. Like it's a whole different league in it to the other. Yeah. Oh my god. It's amazing. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. yeah. Like you say, at that point when I was driving up there then, and I was like, oh my god, oh my god. Because in the FN you would feel like you're at eight, yeah. eight, nine thousand. Yeah, yeah. Whereas this, you look down, you're in like five and a half. You're like, what? Yeah, it's and just, it just still it goes and goes and goes and goes and goes and goes. Yeah, very, very happy. Mm. Nice new silicon hoses and that would be nice on here as well. Very nice. Yeah, can't I'm wait. Quite excited to see what colour theme you're going to go as well. Yeah, actually. it's all up. It's all up here. I've been planning all this right car there. for a very long time. <laughs> I don't no, know what wheels to get yet. It's in it on Need for Speed Heat, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's, yeah, it's on there. To that. <laughs> oh, another thing as well is I noticed that the Clutchmaster cylinder had, was replaced a year ago. I was going through all the, there's loads of history of it. The Clutchmaster cylinder was replaced a year ago. I checked in the footwell underneath and it's not leaking and it does look brand new. The uh, TCT, the timing chain tensioner, was also changed about a year and a half ago. So everything that I was going to do... Has been done pretty much that side of it is is already been yeah. done so whoever's owned it didn't obviously knew what they were doing uh, because all the stuff that goes has been done been the done. soft top's been done as well so yeah i'm over the moon so, Mate, i yeah. think you've definitely got a little gem of them because i, I mean so. it's got the original all the original books with it yeah a stack everything. of history with it yeah I'm it's been well maintained and obviously mm, no the fucking soft top oh, yeah. fucking just under a thousand pounds <laughs> That was two, yeah. the middle of 2018 that was put on. Yes, you've done well there, mate. Yeah, that saved me a fucking shit ton well. of money. So, yeah, I think that's a good spot to end the video. Massive thank you to Dino Day's performance, Parts, and Danny, and for sponsoring the channel, and Tactical Racing, the absolute legends. All their information is down in the description if you want to go and buy all your car parts and whatnot. And there's also a discount code for Tactical Racing. There's two codes. One is Cowabunga, which gets you between 10 and 15% off certain products, and one is Cowabunga 5 which gives you 5% off certain products, which is probably the, the, the smaller bits and bobs. But yeah, amazing. Like, comment, subscribe, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you, know Thank you to all the new subscribers. We've had quite a few. We've had a little influx of 30 odd subscribers over the last week, Ooh, which is amazing. So uh, we're, Get your comments coming in. We love to. I'd love to chat to you. you Tell me chat. what you think, whether you've driven one and how you think it goes in the in the crotch box below. And uh, yeah, we love you all. And we shall see you on the next, next video. video. Peace out. Bye bye.